cause a sensation. The name of the movie is Always. The director is Steven Spielberg, and anything with Spielberg always causes a sensation. Lisa Gibbons joins us today for a report on the most successful filmmaker of the decade. That's a strong statement. And a, an accurate one, I think, John. Thanks. In spite of all that talent and all the hype, I found Steven Spielberg to be very down-to-earth, very approachable. He's maturing as a person, and he's putting that maturity on the screen for the rest of us to share. And if his last film of this decade is any indication, well, we've got a lot to look forward to in the 90s. That dive is way too steep. Way There's too action, steep. adventure, but above all, romance in all ways. It's the story of a pilot who dies and then comes back as an unseen spirit to help the woman he loves persevere and love again. I know you can't see me, but I'm right here. I just wanted to, I want, because the movie is really about... Um, moving your life on and and when to say hello and when to say I love you and when to say goodbye and and it's important that people say those things when they still have the chance Spielberg has said goodbye and moved on in his own life his three and a half year marriage to actress Amy Irving ended in June how did that affect your work I didn't draw from my real life or my you know or any contemporary part of my real life when I made this movie I actually drew from what it felt like when I was a, a kid to not be able to go on a date, to have a girl say, no, I'm not going out with you, you know, or, or, or have somebody that you're going out with for a while break up with you. That's my girl, pal. I have to, to look at you and think, as life kind of chips away at all of us, what does that do to that quality in your filmmaking? It's interesting what you say, because life does chip away at us, you know, and, and life takes its toll. It chips away at me, too, but I try to stay positive and optimistic. You know what I'm saying? I'm not really interested in cynicism or making pictures about people who are cynics. Spielberg's warmth in movies like E.T. helped make him wealthy. His 20 years of directing have won him the admiration of his peers. Still, everyone talks about young Steven it's Spielberg. Well, like this, you know. We're 42 <laughs> next week. That's right. That's right. We're on a lecture circuit next year. Yeah, yeah right. <laughs> What's your greatest joy right now? My greatest joy? My son. Max. Yeah. Being a dad is when you can get right down on the floor with your kids and play with them, not at your level, but at their level, and, and just go with it. And I, I have the best time with him. Can only imagine what it must be like to have him as a daddy. Family, that's the one big ingredient that Steven Spielberg feels is missing from Hollywood today. And really, that's why he's sort of detached himself from it and keeps trying to create that feeling among his small group of friends and colleagues. There's a guy who's turned a lot of people into...